subscapularis is a um, quite, it's a very powerful muscle which is a potent cause of uh, of, of shoulder pain, quite significant cause of shoulder pain. You feel for the free edge of the back of the axilla. So here is the scapula at the back. Your arm is abducted away from the body at 90 degrees and I am now going to pick up this free edge and this free edge is the latissimus dorsi muscle. Uh, Tissimus dorsi muscle sits here. Now, the subscapularis is deep to that. So now I'm digging down beyond. Here is the scapula, and I'm going to, if I can't quite get there, I lift this arm up, and I'm digging in. And it's quite deep. Here, there. So you can see... You can see how deep I'm going in between the scapula and the ribs. So the ribs are here, the scapula is coming around, the latissimus dorsi is here, and you have to go beyond the latissimus dorsi, and the, the pressure is deep in there. There we go. I'm right on it now. Mm. You can actually feel the free edge of the scapula quite deep inside, and then I'm going in front of it. It's quite tender, isn't it? Is that tender? Yes. Yes. It's quite tender. So deep inside. And so if I'm going to do ischemic pressure, so if you just relax your arm, so the further out he goes, it actually gets harder to get in there. So I'm just lifting like that. There we go. And I'm right on it. I'm on the free edge of the scapula in front of it. Now that's sore? Mm. Okay, so now I reduce my pressure. How's that? Okay. okay. Allowed to breathe. <laughs> okay. I'm going to gradually increase the pressure over about 90 seconds. You let me know if it starts hurting. How's that going? Good. Okay. Now I'm pushing slowly harder, and I'll do this over 90 seconds, gradually increasing the pressure until I can push as hard as I like. And then I will. Yeah, okay. okay, so we just keep going. Constant feedback until I'm until until I can push. Now I'm pushing quite a lot harder. That's not too bad. No. Okay, I've shortcut this, but I would go for the whole ninety seconds. So all the trigger points are really really hard to get to, and there are apart from uh, in in order of difficulty. There are three trigger points. The first trigger point is you need to feel the free edge of the scapula, and where the where the the uh, subscapularis runs forward, just off the scapula. That's the first one, and it's just there. Is mm. it? Okay. The second is deeper inside just there and the second if you look when you look at the muscle and you look at the trigger points for the muscle the the second is lower and more medial the third you get to from the other side and if you roll over and you need to lift up the scapula and dig in underneath. And in people who are large and muscular, quite frankly, you'll never get there. You just can't reach. Someone who's thin, so you, I'm bringing the scapula on to my hand and pushing in underneath. And there's a whole lot of other muscles I'm going through. I'm going through the trapezius. I'm going through the rhomboid muscles. And I'm trying to get in underneath. So it's a difficult to get to trigger, and it's not one that um, you can be terribly specific or precise about.